<sighs> I apologize per usual. Albert and Edie decided to start playing right now. <laughs> oh, golly. I took off today because I just needed a day that was not a holiday uh, to be home. So <laughs> I thought this would be a great day and got a package. So today would be a good day to do a little review that I've been wanting to do for a while. It's uh, I have a bunch of different, if you are a lady <laughs> and uh, you have a bust that is bigger than say like an A or a B, finding a like the perfect bra is a struggle. So <laughs> I have tried three different brands of bras. Two that I found on um, Instagram. They're like Instagram ads that I clicked on and stuff. And um, one of them I'm a very big fan of and I've had them for a long time. So I'll show you the three different kinds that I bought uh, from this brand. And then, um, oh, I need to get one. Hold on. Not prepared. Real reviews. It's a no makeup review. So, <laughs> um, so the first brand that I tried from Instagram is called True. True and Co. And I bought three different kinds. This is like a, a V-neck style. And it's so comfy. These, I really love this company. I got it in that pink color and then this blue color. So comfy. Not, not supportive. So if you have big, bigger bust like I do, uh, I have a 36 double D. These will not give you the support that you probably want. But if you like to sleep with a bra on, these are so nice. Or if you just want to have a really comfy day, highly recommend these guys. <laughs> and I will put the pricing in the screen for you. Because I can't remember how much I spent on these. I've had these for uh, at least two years. And they've held up really well. These still look good. I don't wear these as much, so that might be why. I wear this one, it looks, sorry, I just took it out of my gym bag because I <laughs> wore it yesterday and then took it out. Um, so this one is definitely more supportive. It's more coverage. The V-neck just doesn't really do anything. And it has like this sort of faux wire I guess if you want to call it that it's like a extra stitching here that is supposed to kind of give you some support I think but they really don't it's not it's not a supportive bra but it is so so comfy I got size medium and I would kind of like to see what a size small feels like okay so these two are larges and then this one is medium Maybe that's why I like this one better, because it's smaller. I might try and get a small in this and see how it goes. I just figured it wouldn't be too tight or something based on their um, size chart thing. So I really, really like these. I also tried one that does have a wire and it's just like a no padding kind of bra. And it has a little bit extra back here for back coverage um i wore this one a lot and at some point the wire popped through the um like the stitching so this one is missing a wire this side doesn't have a wire and this side does so it still wasn't like it was definitely not a push-up bra but it, it gave a little more support than just the flimsier ones and it was still really really comfortable and I just got it in a 36 double D. So it fit, it fit perfectly. It does say lay flat to dry and I'm pretty sure I never did that. So it might last longer if you don't put it in the dryer. I didn't read the directions, but in any case, so true, I really like the true and company bras. 
especially for really comfy bras. The comfy ones are super comfy. <laughs> this bra next is not super comfy, but it is, it's got great coverage. Like it's called back smoothing technology or something. I have one that I bought at the same time as this. I bought these two at the same time. Um, but this one still has tags on it because uh, I wanted to make sure I liked it before I took the tags off, off of both of them. So, <laughs> this is from, uh, I want to say Lane Bryant, but let me just make sure. And it was $48. Invisible Back Smoother Collection. <laughs> shapes and smooths which it does I wonder if I need to get a bigger um, like maybe go up to 38 I just really don't want to that would be admitting defeat or something I don't know the straps these aren't super uncomfortable they do slide down a lot and you have to like keep adjusting them but they're a little bit wider than a normal bra, I think. A little bit wider. But they feel really um, supportive. So maybe I would like this one better if it was a size bigger. Like the boob size is fine. Thirty, uh, The double D is, is fine. I think that's what I got, right? Yeah, 36 double D. So maybe if I went up to 38... <laughs> Uh, I would like this better, but it definitely helps with this backing area. It definitely helps with the back boob issue. <laughs> and then this I just got today, Lively, which I've been seeing all over Instagram, and I've been wanting to try them, and so I did. They have really great reviews and they make it so easy to return. That's handy. Okay, so I think I will return these actually. They're both um, no wire push-up bras and and they're, they're comfy. Here's the thing. So when you wear a wire bra, like the wire goes all the way up to here and it like separates your boobs, I guess, if that makes sense. And this doesn't have the wire, so it just kind of feels like a sports bra kind of, but I don't know. It's a push-up bra and it definitely felt like it was lifting, which is nice, but I don't like that there's so little fabric back here like this just accentuates back boob really badly. Like it's, it's bad. <laughs> I have some A cups back there. And, uh, and then I just don't really like the middle part where it's like open. It's just like a sports bra, basically. I don't know. The material is really nice. They're nice and soft. I actually like this one better. It doesn't have the see-through. One of these is an all day, which I think is this one. And the other one is just um, a no wire push up, which I think is this one. And so yeah, I, I like this one better that has not, not the see through one. And they both have kind of a cool thing where it also only has two, like, I feel like if, if you're making bras, you should just automatically have three hooks if you have size, um, I don't know, C and up maybe. <laughs> like, there's a lot to hold in there. So, anyway, it has this um, little hooky thing. These feel like plastic. I I could see this easily breaking. That's not. That's not metal, that's plastic. That's kind of upsetting. I don't know, man. So you can make it a racer back is what I'm saying. If I could focus. 
which is nice, but it just really accentuates back boob, which is not nice. Nobody likes that. So the top, <laughs> in review, the top bras for comfort, I would say is this True & Company. Number one, super comfy, love their bras. Number two, I got this recommendation for the Lane Bryant bras from a friend who has bigger boobs than I do and she loves them and she loves the back coverage. She's not, she's fit. She's not fat like me, but, um, but she still likes the back coverage, which is, you know, makes sense. And, um, so she highly recommends these. Maybe I just have the wrong size because I'm being vain, which is silly. I know it's so silly. Um, but these really do give you a lot of coverage and support, which is super nice if you're looking for that. And if you have the correct size <laughs> band, it might, it might work better for you. But there's that. And then this new brand that I just tried, Lively, I'm not a big fan of. Not a huge fan. I might try wearing it today just to see. I'll leave the tags on because you can't return it if you take the tags off. But it needs to have a wider band and it needs more coverage right here. But they're so soft. I really want to like them. If I wear it today, I'll, I'll give you a review of how I liked it. But as of right now, I'm not a huge fan. So there you go. <laughs> Bra talk. Anyway, so thank you so much for watching. I hope this was helpful if you know of a really awesome bra, please let me know because I'm clearly still on the hunt for a supportive bra that is comfortable and preferably wire free or has a wire and is just not uh, restrictive as much as the wires that I usually try. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below if you've tried these and liked them or if you've tried something else and really liked it. I would love to know what your favorite bra is and here in a minute, I'm going to film some Amazon Essential Workout reviews because I am a new found fan of Amazon Essentials everything. So, <laughs> thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you are not already. And I will see you next time. These puppies won't go outside and go potty. <laughs> so, alright, I'll see you next time.